Greetings and welcome to this week's ethical case study based on Merck Cohen Inc. for our ethical and social values of business class. In this week's assessment, we will analyze the ethical dilemma incurring Merck Co. Um, the company is debating. Uh, if it supports the research stages of a pharmaceutical drug which intend to treat river blindness disease, the philosophical appraisals of Amarita San, Robert H. Frank, and Lee Sharpin will support the thesis of the evaluation, providing an assessment uh, on the proposal and the ethical standings of the company regarding this uh, matter. Let us consider that Merck Cohen Inc. for the past 130 years has adapted its organization business model so it can endure the long research phases needed while developing and delivering new pharmaceutical drugs. Um, the model encourages a comprehensive, committed and responsible methods of investment that can sustain the research and examination stages which are essential in the development of the medicine and the vaccines that can change the world. Due to the company's dynamic organization culture, Merck deliberately nurtures the creative minds of thousands of scientists and researchers involved in the different projects of the organization. In addition, the organization believes that all the work produced by the company it is in the pursuit to alleviate human illness. Merck business model follow the guidelines from the company former chairman George W. Merck. Merck's philosophical vision exposes that the medicine it is first for the people and is not for the profit. Profit will accordingly follow as the greatness of the business actions contribute to the wealth and the benefit of the whole. Therefore, a merit business model requires a continuous investment of significant amounts of capital. Additionally, the strategy requires an accumulated allocation of both human talent and quantitative resources to research and produce medicine. In the past, this method has helped Merck develop different types of pharmaceutical drugs. For instance, clinoreal, which is a painkiller used for arthritis, mexophine, a general antibiotic, Timotoc, which is uh, used for the treatment of glaucoma, or Invermicidine, an antiparasitic drug. As a result of, the, of these strategies, merge sales and net income had increased progressively, creating more opportunities and more employees, uh, providing solutions for millions in need, even if the economic viability of the project is none. These concepts align with the model from Robert H. Frank. According to his theory, a social responsible organization can prosper even in, the, in a situation where the organization it is pressured to abandon its agreement. Frank suggests that the success of the organization can only be achieved by solving commitment problems with the employees, the customers, and the uh, other organizations involved. In each circumstance, uh, fixing the dilemma can be associated with the organizational reputation or the corporate ethics. For example, an organization business ethic model can promote management to persuade its workers that in case of any type of problem affecting the workforce will be dealt uh, rightfully. These factors contribute 
to recruit more competent employees, which share a similar code of moral conduct and therefore trust. On the other hand, concerning the organizational customers, a client is willing to pay a premium fee if the seller shows commitment to providing a product or service of a higher quality. Hence, competitive advantage it is generated as trust as the client towards the organization output, outputs surpasses the customer's expectations. Concerning the other organizations involved, let us consider that the companies uh, compete towards the attention of potential customers, losing the perception of building a relationship with the customer. Thus, quantifiable incentives are insufficient to resolve the commitment dilemma. Competitive edge it is created when the business organization confronts the ethical dilemma by solving commitment problems, better opportunistic rivals, even if that implies incurring in high expenditures. According to Amir Tassen, establishing high standards of business ethics is without a doubt a proper method of confronting behavioral problems of mutual confidence. Sen concurs with Adam Smith's ethical beliefs that exposes that is not sufficient to focus on the motivational factors that make an individual pursue an exchange. For example, a benefit or gratification achieved from the trade it is not only satisfied, it is necessary or still imperative to analyze and understand the behavioral patterns that promote the sustainability of a prosperous system of equal profitable exchanges. Moreover, if we extend this concept to the production and distribution perspective, it is required for organization business um, ethics to become even more influential and perspicuous as, it, as the issue of trust is vital to all economical operations involving the company. Best practices recommend managerial comprehension to diminish agency problems concerning issues related to trust, awarding financial compensations for accomplishing objectives offering fixed stock prices and often promotions inside the company creates a significant shared value of ownership between parties. Therefore, the organization is encouraging the direct creation of synergy within its members. These factors also contribute to the development of values such as owner and integrity. We must analyze overall success of Merck with the correlation of the facts of the organization business practices follow a motiv motivational structure that departs from the search of its self-interest and exclusive maximization of profits. Merck's understand that the organization outputs are public goods from which all sh uh, stakeholders can contribute and benefit, and benefit equally economic sense then uh, should center in the achievement of a better society. As Andrew Carnegie's concepts of wealth, the organization distribution improvements of the society is a reward itself. The interpretation of sense vision of economical sense classifies into two separate factors. The first factor uh, it is the first economic sense which interprets as an achievement of profits by implementing regular valuation measurements. This factor contributes to a better control of the different business operation practices. In other words, the usage of instruments measurements indirectly promotes the generation of revenues. Secondly, the second, the second sense is the improvement of the society is considered as a war itself. Even though these two factors are divergent and independent, they should be incorporated in the creation of a consequential business analysis. Consequently, Merck's business ethics must relate to both features. Even if the prior
project, it is not economically viable. It is recommended to Merck to keep investing in the research that is part of the corporate duty, owner, and integrity embodied in the business mission. Based on the philosophical ideologies from Richard Payne, integrity should be an organization principle and the guideline. First, let us consider the Merck follows institutional practices that comply with international laws, regulations, to avoid any legal uh, sanction or any penalty. On the other hand, it is essential to follow the principles regarding integrity suggested by Sharp Pain. According to the principle, integrity is based on the concept of self-governance and how it incorporates to a unified framework of guided values. Let us highlight then that Mark Merck considers the integrity strategy as a driving force in the organization. Merck ethical values shape the search of the opportunities as well as the influence the organization system and the decision making process. These ethical factors contribute to define what the company is and what it stands for. Merck medicine will be always first for the let us emphasize that no benefits from liable environments or absence of epidemics. For the, man for the managerial perspective, there is an opportunity to develop the drug. In 1978, the U.S. Congress approved a grant pharmaceutical, grant pharmaceutical companies benefits such as tax breaks and exclusive marketing rights for manufacturing rare drugs afflicting fewer than 200,000 Americans. In this case, the river blind, uh, blindness disease is affecting currently 80 million of people globally. America is willing to provide the medicine for free for those countries that require help. Being a social responsible company influencing the perception of the company and the customers as they are willing to pay higher prices for the quality and integrity of our products. As Merck, values and incentive centers of the achievement of the value society will contribute to create differentiation strategies and competitive advantage that promotes profitability in the long run of the operations. Thank you.